What's up guys, Vanatics here, and I got a really cool project that I wanted to share with you guys. I came across it just the other day, and I just kept on playing it, and I felt you guys should see about this. It's called Eternal Evil, and it's a zombie type killing game, or it may be even considered ghouls, I'm not sure. But it's in an apocalyptic event that destroyed a small town, and it literally just throws you into this dark town in the middle of the night, and you get a pistol. And before you know it, there's zombies right in front of your face that you're just trying to survive, but you have limited ammo, so you're forced to scavenge and search throughout this level. Now, keep in mind that this game is currently free, and it's pretty much a demo of what will be coming. So if you want to go on Steam and download it, give it a try. I highly recommend it. But the crazy thing about this is that the dark atmosphere with blood and gore is fantastic. It has a good story, more or less, because there's actually something, an objective for you to do. But the best thing I like about it is there's no waypoints, there's no arrow telling you where to go and how to do it. But instead, that there are puzzles and journals left behind that actually leave valuable information. It's no longer a lore journal where it's like, oh, this event took place here, but it has nothing to do with the actual story or campaign or objectives that you're working on. But in this game, you find a journal and it talks about an event that happened, which just so happens to talk about the combination to the lock. But he says that he needed to change it, so you need to figure that out. And it kind of has like a riddle built into this journal. And so you're on this adventure to try to find Brian, who then you find his bar, and then you have to try to open this door. But between all this going on, you're trying to find these zombies. And again, you're not directed directly to the bar so you could go other directions now i will say it's not very big right now as i mentioned it is just a demo but boy do i think it is worth your time but the really cool thing about this is is if and when the game actually comes out there's going to be a bunch of levels and locations and different type of enemies including levels of difficulty this type of game gives off that old school survival horror experience and it also has physics based damage system with enemy dismemberment which i thought was really cool you'll notice that sometimes when i shoot them in the head the head explodes entirely or shooting off legs and limbs and stuff like that it feels good and there's quite a few weapons that you'll be able to find. And the best thing is, they're not just given to you. You need to find them. And I think that's what makes this game awesome. And I really look forward to see what happens in its development stages and hope for this game to come out in the near future. I actually want to show you the gameplay of the demo here to see what you guys think about it. It's going to be completely um, uncut and just straight live action. I hope you guys enjoy it. If you guys are interested in more zombie games, make sure to drop a like and subscribe. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoy and we'll see you in the next one.